Hi friends, welcome to repair time. The problem of this Samsung tablet is a dead short at the charger input, this one. And the model of this tablet is A9X115. So if you have one of these USB voltage and current meters, I highly recommend you to get one of these because they are pretty cheap and handy. If I connect the cable to the input, You see, it totally turns off the charger because charger is a switching power supply and when it detects a short at the output, it turns off the power supply. So it's a dead short, pretty obvious. I have already disassembled the LCD. You should, very, you should be very careful when you disassemble such devices because LCD is pretty expensive and an original LCD is at least 50% of the price or the value of this device. So here is the board battery. When there is a dead short here, the problem is either this one, this one or both of them. So we should test. First use a plastic tool like this, disconnect the battery connector like this, pretty easy. Then I should disconnect this ribbon cable or flat cable. I think it's better that I continue the rest of the repair under the microscope. I will test this board and also the motherboard. All right, this is the input board. I mean the board where this USB Type-C connector is located and you will connect your uh, charger cable to this port. And this board is connected to the main board through this FPC connector and a flat cable. I tested the same FPC connector on the main board and it did not show any sign of short or malfunction. But my microscope did not record that video for some reason. But very likely the motherboard is fine. So the, the short should be on this connector. Let's check. So there is a dead short on this connector. Let's check this side. And there we go. Uh, clearly there is a burn sign on this component. I'm not sure what component it is. 24A. It is a protection or whatever. If you know what component is this one, just let me know in the comment section because I can save this board for future repairs. But for now, I will just replace this board because I can find the replacement boards in the market. So I'm sure 99% sure that replacing the board will solve the problem because as I said, I did not find any sign of short or malfunction on the main board side. All right, I assembled the tablet again. You see that? Let me put back the LCD. It's pretty sensitive. And now I want to test. So here is the USB voltage and current meter. Let's connect this to the tablet. And there we go. It draws current. This is a good sign. Oh, it goes to fast charge, eight volts and 1.6 amps. And the tablet is on. The tablet is on. Pretty nice. If you know the part number of that chip in the input board, just let me know in the comments. I hope you like this video. Give me a big thumbs up. We will do something else in the next video.